So when a patient develops a slow heartbeat because of various reasons, it makes the patient sick, he either feels breathless, fatigued, sometimes even fainting. Slow heartbeat happen in older individuals because of what we call degenerative AV block or because of sick sinus syndrome where the patient's own pacemaker becomes weak and fails to generate heartbeat at the required rate. The usual therapy for this is to put a permanent pacemaker which is a small device about uh, one and a half by one and a half inches in size which is placed beneath the left collarbone under the skin and will have typically two wires which go through the vein into the heart. Now this has been the uh, technology that has been in vogue for almost two decades or more now. Some patients however cannot have this traditional pacemaker because they have a problem with their veins. Like for example a patient who has been on dialysis for a long time and therefore the veins under, behind the collarbone are narrow so or the, it has been used for using the dialysis axis. In such a patient we cannot use the traditional pacemakers. So for such kind of patients when they need pacemaker, the leadless pacemaker is a boon. Now these are small devices which are also implanted percutaneously without surgery through the groin vein under local anesthesia in a short procedure wherein you put a capsule like pacemaker right into the tip of the right sided ventricle lower chamber and once positioned over there it itself recognizes whether the patient's heartbeat is slow or, or normal and then paces the ventricle to make sure that the heartbeat is maintained above a certain set threshold.